Electric Vehicles Explained. Today you can buy vehicles for your business that are fully electric, as well as vehicles that are part electric, which are able to run on electricity for shorter journeys before continuing on petrol or diesel power. Electric vehicles are almost silent, and because there's no clutch or gears, they're ideal to drive in cities. Pure EVs and plug-in hybrids and extended range electric vehicles, while being driven on electric power, emit zero tailpipe carbon dioxide emissions and air pollutants. Man-made CO2 emissions are a key contributor to climate change. Local air pollutants, such as nitrogen dioxide and particulate matter, are known to increase rates of heart and lung disease, cancer and asthma. Battery electric vehicles, or BEVs, are powered 100% by electricity and don't need any other fuel such as petrol or diesel. The range of modern battery electric vehicles is continually improving and a range of 100 to 200 miles is becoming the norm, making them suitable for the vast majority of everyday journeys. Plug-in hybrid electric vehicles, or PHEVs, combine petrol or diesel engines with a battery and electric motor to enable a longer driving range. They can be plugged into the mains electricity to charge the battery and can drive on purely electric power for shorter distances. Extended range electric vehicles, or EREVs, like BEVs, are always driven by an electric motor which takes energy from a battery. If the battery becomes depleted, a petrol engine is used to generate electricity to power the electric motor. An EREV will provide you with an electric-only range of up to 125 miles, depending on the model, with the petrol generator providing a total range in excess of 200 miles. A plug-in vehicle, whether an EV, an E-Rev or a plug-in hybrid, may be suitable for you depending on your driving patterns and your local recharging infrastructure. There are also electric vans available, which are suitable for a range of applications, with most models having ranges of more than 100 miles. What are the benefits of electric vehicles? Low running costs. Whilst initial upfront cost can be higher, electric vehicles are very cheap to run. Electric cars only cost a few pounds to fully charge, especially if an off-peak overnight tariff has been subscribed to. A petrol or diesel car costs 11 to 16 pounds to drive 100 miles, around four times the three to five pounds this same distance would cost in an electric car. A good guide to the fuel savings that are possible is 100 pounds saving per 1,000 miles driven. Pure EVs costing no more than £40,000 have a zero rate of vehicle excise duty or road tax. Company car tax. For company car drivers, cars emitting no more than 50 grams of CO2 per kilometre pay the lowest rates of company car tax. Plug-in cars and vans emitting 75 grams of carbon dioxide per kilometre or less attract a 100% discount on the London congestion charge. Over the course of the year, with regular visits, this could total over £2,000 a year. Electric vehicles benefit from free or subsidised parking in some areas. Many urban areas around the UK are now, or are likely to be, subject to clean air zones. The impact of these zones will vary, but emission surcharges for polluting vehicles and the implementation of low emission zones are likely. Low emission vehicles like pure EVs, PHEVs and EREVs can help tackle air pollution and can save you money by avoiding these surcharges. Certain electric vehicles qualify for a government grant dependent on their total emissions and zero emission range. The plug-in car grant provides a grant of 35% of the cost of a plug-in car up to a maximum of either £2,500 or £4,500 depending on the model. The plug-in van grant provides a grant of up to 20%, up to £8,000, while the plug-in motorcycle grant provides a grant of 20% of the cost, up to a maximum of £1,500. Businesses buying electric vehicles can write down 100% of the purchase price against their corporation tax liability. If the vehicle emits no more than 75 grams of carbon dioxide per kilometre and less than 50 grams of carbon dioxide per kilometre from the 2018-19 tax year. Charging your plug-in vehicle. The extensive and growing UK-wide network of charging infrastructure provides coverage in many areas through subscription or pay-as-you-go charge services. 
rapid chargers, which can top up a battery to 80% in 20 to 30 minutes, are becoming more common and are in place at most service stations on the motorway and main road network. A number of grants are available to assist with the cost of installing charge points. Electric vehicle users can receive funding from the Office for Low Emission Vehicles to install a home charger for their plug-in vehicle, which can provide a grant of up to 75% of the eligible costs of installation up to £500. For residents without a garage or driveway, the on-street residential charge point scheme is aimed at local authorities, who can apply for a grant to part fund up to 75% of the capital costs relating to the procurement and installation of on-street electric vehicle charge point infrastructure in residential areas. The Workplace Charging Scheme provides support towards the upfront costs of the purchase and installation of electric vehicle charge points up to £300 per charge point for use in the workplace. The Energy Saving Trust can provide more information on any aspects of electric and low emission vehicles. Visit energysavingtrust.org.uk slash travel for more information.